Kia ora, te whanau. A very big welcome to you for this Level 2, End of Term 3 Assembly. It's always a wonderful occasion, our End of Term Assembly, but today there is a touch of sadness because not we're giving lots of certificates and people are being awarded lots of different accolades within our school, but today we are sad about Miss Hines leaving us after 13 years of wonderful service at Grey Main. I would like to ask Millie Brown to come forward and up here Millie and lead us in Karakia please. Only lose a 
train once a week to go to the toilet. There are two time slots and three time slots. Cheaters are mammals. They have dots all over their skin. A cheetah's tail helps them carry when it is running. They are part of the cat family. Cheetahs are mammals. They run their top speed is 70 kilometers. They live in burrows or lumps of grass. They eat twigs carrots and bark. They have yellow brown fur. They run fast and are great jumpers. They weigh about three to five kgs. Their length is 60 to 75 centimeters. Male hares are called Jack. Female hares are called Jill. Sloths are mammals. They live in America. They live in trees. They eat leaves and bark. They are a big gray black brown dog and has a little nose and two little eyes. And they have two or three names. They transport by crawling or swimming. Baby sloths have to be fed three times a day. It takes a sloth to do one mile in a whole month. Cheetahs. They don't roar like a house cat. They purr. They are the world's, world's fastest mammal. They turn with their tail. Too, because he gets 
very crazy when you have a thing for a walk. Okay, so what are we going to do with those pieces of paper? Will we just leave them there? Oh, them. You'll flip them? Okay, so you go and stand up, P3, and some of you sit on the seats at the back, and some of you sit just in front. They gave you a big sister. It was someone like a tuakana, like we say tuakana taina. So I was the taina, and my tuakana was my big sister. And her name was Judith Liddell in those days. And she's sitting over there because she's come to our assembly today to be um, represent the Westpac Bank. Because every year we get the opportunity to nominate someone in our school for the Blake Leaders Award. Someone in our school who we believe is a leader here, but will go on to great things like Peter Blake did. So um, I'm going to ask um, one of my assistants to what, look at the um, Peter Blake video. And for you little people, you can aspire to be a young leader one day. So let's watch it. Pack when they arrive through the post. 
So, um, as I said before, it gives me great pleasure to um, ask Judith Whitey, she is now, my big sister, my tuakana, to come and present the um, Peter, Sir Peter Blake Award. Congratulations um, on that award. And I'm very sorry that your whanau couldn't be here today, but um, as you can see, there are going to be lots and lots of awards today. And I, I couldn't invite one without the others because every one of them is kind of very special. So um, as I said to you before, it's Miss Hines' 
last day today. So she's going to present the principal awards. Um, and I'll um, read them out. So the first ones are the principal's um, Manakatanga awards today. Um, Manakatanga in our school is one of our values. It's honesty, integrity, um, showing respect, being the best person you can be. Uh, caring, kind, all of the things that are great attributes that we believe in at Grey Main. And in Rata 1, our new entrant class, the person who shows great Manaki in R3 is Isaiah Bolt. Isaiah Bolt. And Isaiah's just started school not long ago, and he is a delightful young learner. Here we go, go down to Miss T. And in R2, the learner who displays wonderful monarchy, and I see this every time I'm on duty, Caden McCaskill. Up you come, Caden. And it's so special because Miss Hines is your mummy's best friend, and she's going to give you that. Oh, oh that's cool. And in R3, congratulations go to Marley O'Neill. And Marley, I think you've had a principal award this year. And I think you had one of the, well, um, effort and achievement ones. So that's fantastic. Not many people get two principals awards. Um, and in P1, a congratulations and happy birthday for tomorrow, Lewis Phillips Todd. Yay! Oh, well done, Lewis. <laughs> Gosh, if anyone gets um, top, top, oh, you had two. Yeah, it was last year and um, this year. Fantastic. You get top marks for enthusiasm, too. Um, and P3, P2, the person who shows true monarchy in that room is Keelan Patterson Gerard. Well done, Keelan. And Keelan, I hate to say you've got one more turn of the hotel cover, but you look as if you're ready to join Marco. Look how tall you've got. Scarlet Wade, you are a wonderful learner in our school for P3 and show Manaki. Thank you very much. In M1, and I had this person in my bubble during level three, and she is kind, and she is sweet, and she looks after others, and particularly Ryan, Jenny Robinson, up you come. And congratulations to this learner. I'm so impressed with this learner. She's turned herself around and she's coming to school every day and doing lots of learning, but she's also got a very big heart. Well done, Brooklyn Kenkett. Congratulations. M3, I'd like to congratulate Kira Hayden. Where are you, Kira? Thank you for showing kindness, respect. And in T1, not surprised at all about this, well done to Olivia Cowley. And in T2, a big thank you for being the best person you can be, Siobhan Jordan. And in T3, it's great that a new person coming to our school can just fit in and show Manaki Caden Sermon up you come. I must say, children, it's a pleasure um, taking assembly today. You are behaving beautifully. Let's give them a big party party. <laughs>
Rich Nations. And in our praise, Alyssa Whitlow Smith, you are a wonderful person. And P1, congratulations go to Sophie Seifert, the happiest person I have. And P2, you've worked really hard to hem Hendrix McKay up you come. Over there, 
just line them up and give you a big pucky pucky. Kai Gibson, Lily Gamble Smith, Miller Boniface, Madison Cousins, Cara Ball, Hannah Saw, Gabby Gillies, Betty Barry, Eleanor Harrington, Alex Mason, and George Cronin. The use of Toreo was excellent. Too many. Well done, Sam. Damien Morrow, the effort you are putting into your work, keep it up. I'm proud of you, Damien. That's from Miss K. Oh, and my anchor man. My anchor man, Tyler, you can't drop that camera, okay? The way you've stepped up this term, helping with all things digital. Congratulations. We'll put it on the table there, on your desk. 
Miro Washard, the fabulous way of learning you had this week, the effort you put into your writing is a credit to you. And Sam Belcher, the fabulous persuasive writing, you should be proud of the effort you put into this, it certainly persuaded me. What was it? Was it about wearing jewellery at school? Nail polish? I don't know. Oh, blueberry donuts, great. Okay, and T1 I'm from Mr. B, for adapting to change and showing a happy disposition with some snapping, snappy dance moves. Where is Van? Up you come, Van, good man. Van DR. And Olivia Cowie, another award for you for being a calm, collected and constructive leader in T1. And Siobhan Jordan, the superb effort you've shown in all your work this term, the world needs more people like you. Need taken. For working hard on your passion project, what a great topic you have chosen, Kapai Ning. What is the topic? Um, world War II. World War II. Thomas Birmingham, a great attitude to learning and being a good role model to others. Thanks, Tom. And Aidan Kalitsky, is Aidan here? Not here today. His um, recognition is for his positive attitude to learning and the kindness he shows to others. So let's give these learners a big puppy. Sophie must be the kindness in your family. 
And today, whoa, 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 whoa. Take those hands and you nod all out. Get into them before you give them to your brother. All right? Well done. Hey, can you keep it a bit of a secret that he's getting that and give it to him later? That would be great. Okay, Eleanor Harrington and Ashley Weir, your leadership in preparing the school garden for planting. Could you come forward and receive your certificates? They've been working hard with Miss P's father, Jim, in the garden and in the greenhouse. Ashley Weir and Eleanor. Let's pucky pucky for that. her last assembly. It's a bit of a crazy assembly because this is not how we normally have assemblies. But you people are very special and you are allowed to be part of this, the audience. We will put the video um, up on the um, Facebook page as I said as a separate video. But you will see there, um, in the picture on that side, there's Miss Hines quite a few years ago. We were getting our office block done up and um, all the staff in the offices were all in the tech centre and it was too noisy in there for me so they bought me a little box, a little sort of sleep out thing and it was my office and it just sat at the end of the hall, just beside the hall there. And one day, one morning, it was a winter morning, see I've got a coat on, and I came to work and they had put plastic wrap all around it and I couldn't get in because it was plastic wrapped, so I had to cut all the plastic off to get in. They used to play tricks on me. And then one day I came to work, and my whole office was covered in post-its. They were everywhere. They were all over the desk, all over the computer, all over the cupboards, everywhere, post-its. Another time, I went away to Christchurch for a meeting, and it was when planking was in, and they all planked and sent me a photo. We're having a wonderful time at Grand Line while you're away. And they even had some of the staff children there. Up the top, you'll see Mr. Wood's girl, um, Ella, lying on the table there. Who's in the pink jacket? Yeah. Tech, Miss Power. <laughs> Miss Power's in the pink jacket. Mrs. McFarlane was there. Um, and Mr. Wood up the top. And who's the other person up there? Miss Panther. Okay, but Miss Hyde, you were here. Oh, planking probably. No, I'm So there we go. That was some of the tricks they used to play on me. And we are really going to miss Miss Hines. So a few of us put together a little video for her. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 
one of our favourites, The Sound of Music. So um, I'd like to ask Miller and Nate to come forward, please. We've had a farewell week. It started last Friday with a little party. And um, we have been saying farewell to Miss Hines all week. We've got a morning tea today and we've got some more gifts to give out. But on behalf of the pupils at Grey Lane School, um, we gave flowers last week. We'd like to say a very big thank you to Miss Hines for everything you have done, the work you did on those early productions, the um, year seven and eights. You have been amazing, and we are going to miss you very, very much. So up you come. She's off to some pets, and she's going to be the deputy principal there, and we know she's going to be the very best. Thank you. 